Hey there guys, this is Obsidian Chill. Got another video for you today. And in this one, I'll be breaking down each and every one of the survival mode vendor uh, rewards. These will be the rewards that uh, unlock when you complete the corresponding rounds. Uh, I do have a separate video coming for the, the individual rewards that drop inside the rounds. I'm still waiting on to, to get a few drops. But uh, if you're not familiar with the process, when you complete round five, these will be unlockable. The housing chrome kennel and the legion turret tier three. When you complete round 10, these will be unlockable. The housing six dimensional kennel and the six dimensional crystal turret. When you complete round 15, you're going to get the companion's chrome kennel and legion drone tier three unlockable. Round 20 is going to be the companion six dimensional kennel and the six dimensional drone unlock. Chrome Severe's accessory is round 25, and the cracked source material is round 30. So to touch on the actual rewards here, for the housing chrome kennels, we can preview them here in the base menu. These are just going to be reskins of, uh, of previous years. Oh, I skipped right by mini. So we got the mini cat one. We got mini dog. We got the eagle that looks more like a turkey right now, but uh, it's definitely, when you have it in your base, it flies around. We've got Harambe. And then we've got Groot. In terms of Legion Turret, we're gonna show that right here. So for the housing six dimensional kennel, we'll jump back to the base item tab. We've got the six dimensional cat, six dimensional dog, six dimensional turkey eagle. We've got the six dimensional Harambe and then the six dimensional Groot. For the six dimensional crystal tier, tier three, we'll show that here. Now for the companion chromes, it's the, it's the exact same concept as the base item, except these will follow you as actual physical pets. So we'll just open a box here. So anytime you open up the box, you can choose which one you want. Uh, we'll just go for Rambe in this case. And then this will act as an actual trinket summon that uh, he will follow us around. It doesn't do any damage. It, it's just a purely uh, cosmetic pet. Now for the Legion drone tier three, let's show that here. For the companion six dimensional kennel, we'll pick the eagle so we can actually show you guys what it likes flying around. And that's what the eagle looked like. Same concept as what it'll look like in your base. And then the six dimensional drone tier three, we'll show that here.
So for the round 25 reward, we're looking at the Chrome Spheres accessory. And these will be similar to the uh, spheres that we have on uh, round 5, 15, and 25 with the uh, Evil Cosmic Boy. But that's your round, uh, that's your round 25 reward. So the reward unlock for round 30 is the cracked source material, which we'll check out here. And this one, unfortunately, it's not a chroma, so we don't have the breakdown. I really wish they would have done a chroma like season two, where we had the, the zoo source chroma. But in terms of the actual, we'll just break it down here. And we'll play around with some of the styles on the chest. And then we can put on the legs here. look at it. Actually we should probably do the hands too so it just doesn't look weird. So that's essentially the source crack source there. It doesn't look like it has any movement effects to it. It looks like it's just all lighting effects as far as I can tell. I mean, it's not necessarily a bad material, but I wouldn't have uh, I wouldn't have put this as round 30 reward compared to like say uh, Zeus's lightning bolt, which is round 30. But I guess comparatively, when you compare round 30 rewards a back style to a material, then yes, that's an upgrade. And then we do have another material. On the regular survival mode vendor, we have uh, two new styles. We have the dimensional material, the six dimensional aura, and then a few hairstyles here. One female, two males, which is basically just a, like a, um, can I preview it here? No, no, because I'm wearing a head style. But essentially it's like a cowlick with a beard. But we can uh, show you here the six dimensional. And then the same one with this one, it is uh, color coded. So you can move it around if you'd like, make different color combinations. And then with the actual aura, that's what it'll look like here. Which is gonna be similar to the effect that you'd uh, we saw on the trinkets. And these ones are not tied to unlocks. Uh, just as, as long as you're playing SM, you can buy these. So that's 200 uh, data chips, 100 data chips. Same thing as our previous years, the Chromatic Ember, the Holographic, uh, there's the Zeus Chroma that I wear, the Hologram. These are all the base items. These are all purchasable full time. There's no uh, round locks tied to them. So you can purchase these right away or the previous ones. The only ones that are tied to round unlocks are the actual vendor trinket here, the seasonal vendor.